With Blue Beetle right around the corner, WB Discovery is promoting the film by putting brand new promotional displays out around the world. And of course, these contain previous DC films up for sales at discounts. But as people have noticed, WB got a WB and promote a canceled film. So this image was posted by a DC fan online who was happy to see Blue Beetle getting more promotional work, which honestly is very refreshing. You can see on this that they're selling a lot of, uh, you know, things related to Blue Beetle. It's very smart, very good tactic. Um, I wish they would do this a lot more, honestly. But yeah, Blue Beetle, he's getting the promotion he deserves. But people looking at this quickly realized, hold up a second. Hold up. What's this? There's your Aquaman 2 and some other films that are out and or came out, coming out. And then, hold up. There's Batgirl. There's, there's Batgirl. Huh. I mean, at this point, WB Discovery has become a punching bag. So what more can I say outside of this is tone deaf and stupid? But, hey, that's WB for you, right? Um, Look... This whole thing is a complete mess with them. This, I'm going to give them the benefit of a doubt that this promotional work was commissioned a year ago to be able to get enough of it. But did nobody tell them that Batgirl wasn't coming out or that maybe they should scratch it off there or quickly edit it or, I don't know, put a sticker over it or something? Like, we've seen this happen before with video games and movies. Sometimes it's missing a feature or something, so to put a sticker over it. I mean, it happens, but this is just, it is, I don't want to say I'm shocked, but I'm not. Oh, WB Discovery has dropped the ball with DC promoting just about every possible way you can. And this is another one, just reminding people what you canceled out there in the public. It's, it's just not a good look, not a good look at all. I've seen some people speculate, maybe this is them teasing a shadow drop of it. They're going to suddenly put it out there. Um... I'm going to shatter those dreams right now because no, they're not. They got the $90 million write off and got the $90 million back. And um, if the flash could barely make 200 million at the box office, Batgirl isn't going to make any money. So this ain't releasing. Sorry guys. 